Hi everyone, this is Laurels, here with a new episode of Neopets the Darkest Fairy. In the last episode, we defeated the Wereloop King, getting Illison's charm back, and also getting revenge on the death of our friend, the old knight, who we actually didn't actually know his first name. Oh well, but here we are, we're about to head right back into Meridel territory. I decided to make an executive decision here, and I'm going to do a little mini quest. One of the little silver quests, the Creludian Sword. It's in the Draconac Ridge. If I complete it, I'll get a more powerful sword. And yeah, because I've, yeah, our sword, it's kind of old. We got this sword in Cogham. You remember Cogham? We were still, a, like, a squire back then. It's time for an upgrade. Also, did I mention this place that we're going to is filled with the undead? Yes. So let's see if I can just rush there quickly. I have a light moat on my armor because I'm more afraid of running into, like, mm, light magicians. I believe they're magicians. It's either magician or sorcerer. I can't remember those. But I got a feeling we can make it. We can totally make it without getting hit by anything. Maybe I should switch to our art, like to something else, because those artilleries are gonna screw me over really good. Oh man, that fire artillery is like. Why did I stop moving? Wait a minute. Ah ha ha! You got me. Look at me using the quick menus. The artillery guy didn't hit me when I was standing still. That is something trippy to behold. Keep going, keep going. I don't know what that guy's labeled as. He's orange for some reason. Keep going, keep going. Don't stop believing. Hold on to that feeling. Uh, uh, that's not gonna get caught by YouTube copyright claim. No, not at all, because I'm being surrounded. Ha! You can't climb ledges. Uh, oh, jeez. Dark Meridale has a pretty theme. Okay, that's enough of that. Lest YouTube will find a way to get a copyright strike on here. Ah, uh, Draconax are still flipping everywhere. That's why it is important to take all the dragon acts out that you can before reaching Act 3. Of course, some of these little buggers won't go away because they're set to stay here forever. This is the wrong way. Oh, oh. Uh-uh. I've had it with your shenanigans, and I will not have it, sir. Okay. Just a little bit further, and we will be able to reach our, like, quest point. See those smoke clouds? Uh, no time for golden grass. Must keep running. Must keep running, must keep running, must keep running. Something heavy is following me. Oh no, it's that one over there. Okay. Made it. Made it again. Now I don't have any maps. Nope, I took care of all of those in Act 1. Okay. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Just keep going. Might have been smarter to s start this adventure off at the mouth of the cave. Man, I wish I did the Cogham mission first. Okay. Just gonna do a quick little save right over this one where loop woods. Okay. 
Now let's go. Now we want to enter in to this cave. You guys remember this cave from Act 1, right? Well, we go in here. And you keep running because not only are there Draconax, but there's this huge brute that's right behind us. Now there's this door over here that we weren't able to open, but we have the key now so we can go inside. I had to rush that because I was like, ah, screaming my head off. Okay, now to get properly equipped. Uh, undead are all light aligned, right? Uh, I hear you. There you are. I hear the undead. Now there is a sorcerer in here. So if I can find this sorcerer and take him out. If there's an undead right behind me, I swear. Bring it! Okay, I don't know where I'm going in all of this mess. Uh, but yeah, welcome to the old mine where there are nine treasures. We got five of them already. Guess they're counting the uh, outside cave as well. Okay, works for me. But yeah, look at all this green rock. Prelulite, or whatever it's called. Space rocks. Nope, nope, nope. You can hit them to get some Neo points. Now let's see. I hear a fighter. Am I gonna look at the fighter? I don't want him to be right behind me. Please don't let him be right behind me. Please don't let him be right behind me. Please don't let him be right behind me. No, he's not right behind me. Ooh, Starlight Potion. We actually haven't got one of these. This is said to hold the light of a hundred stars in it. When it's uncorked, it dispels all evil magic nearby. Neat. Yeah, okay. Whatever you say. Oh, there's the fighter. Nope. Come on, there's guys on floors below me trying to get at me. Come on. What was that? Oh, the spells are coming through the floor from that magician. That sorcerer is a bad news bear, and I'm gonna... Oh, hi. Dumb skeleton. Aptly named. Where is that... Where is that, like, sorcerer? I'm gonna get him. Okay. Maybe if I go this way. Found him. Oh no, that you're not the right one. Oh, but you are. Another treasure chest here. Oh, one of these. Those are so useless. This guy's back again we didn't seal that sorcerer down in time. Okay, I think I should use some negs. Hold on a second. And one of these. Two of those. Okay. Now let's see. I hear the undead. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, great. I'm lost inside this cave system again. Uh, another one. No, 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 no. You teleported over there. That was unfair. Uh, maybe we should consider getting out of this cave instead of killing every, like, skeleton we see. That was not worth it. Okay. What way are we going? There is- there, I know there's an entrance into the middle section, and that's where we're going for. That is our- oh, here it is. Uh, no? 
No, don't care. Uh, there we go. Chunk from the meteor. I hope it's safe to touch. Uh, probably not, because look how many undead things are spawning around here. Uh, 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 keep going. Don't let the magician knock you off the ladder door. Just don't do it. Okay, now we're back at the top. Now let's get out of here. Uh, I went down the wrong path. Oh, great. Not this again. Uh, went this way. And then I turned down here. There's a dumb skeleton. And I'm just gonna make a run for it. Ah, here it is. There's the exit. There's the exit. Uh, now let's see if I can get out this cave alive. Keep going. Just run through the cloud. No, don't look back. Don't look back. Do not look back. Ah, oh, jeez! Get out of here! I fail to hit you every single time. I know I'm not using the properly aligned sword. I don't care. Draconek Fang. Uh, but he's not gonna pay me for that. Whatever. Hold on. Negs are gonna be my life now. I'm just gonna head back to Bogshot, cut out the rest of that journey for you, unless something interesting happens. Actually, there will be something that interesting that happens. I'll just cut to that instead. Okay, on our way back to Bogshot. Just walked out of the Draconek Canyon, whatever. Ah, it finally appeared. Uh, if you jump down here, treasure chest from earlier that I skipped over because I said we'd be getting to it, and we in fact did. Uh, I'm gonna get attacked by this warrior right now, but I don't give a crud. I'm just gonna... Let's see, he's water aligned, right? Gonna attach a fire moat my sword. Heal myself right now. And nope. Oh, great. And there's a minion right behind me. Nope. I'm done. I'm out of here. Dun 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 dun. I'll meet you back in bog shot, folks. All right, we're back here in Bogshot. That didn't take that much time at all, she said. Now we go to the sword shop that's just right over to the left. Mm. Welcome back. It's welcome to be back. Uh, talking to you is difficult. That's it, I recognize that glow anywhere. We'll work on it immediately. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Hmm. Hmm. Sigh. <sighs> Yawn. Sigh. Hmm. Is that it? it? Wait, why is Grim Grimnar talking like Tor? That was weird. It is a true Creludian blade for saving my home. Yeah, now we got a sweet looking sword. Look at that. Got green jewels and put into it. It's got a nice looking sword. Ah. Okay, now. We can continue on with our adventure, which means I have to go back to Meridel again. <sighs> See you in a bit. <laughs> Why? And we're back in Meridel territory again. I have a Mirka speed potion boost going on right here, which is why I'm moving incredibly fast. Ah, uh, traveling companion needed for this game. Anyway, where we're heading off to is dun dun dun, dun Tor's farm. That's right. His family is in trouble. Wow, I just seem to be moving really, really slow now. <laughs> we have to head through the Drakenak Ridge again to get there. Uh, but, yeah. Necessary thing, definitely a necessary thing before facing whatever is in charge of Illison's Glade and saving Illison, all that stuff. We do, in fact, need to get to this place before that. 
I'm not even looking back because I know I'm gonna get my butt handed to me by a ton of minions because those guys are so strong still. Uh, they'll become less strong later on, but right now it's easier to just avoid. Oh, great. Just keep running. Maybe I'll speed up this part. You guys don't want to see me running back and forth between places. Sad face. <laughs> uh, but before I do that, uh, how was your day, guys? Nine's doing relatively okay. Starting to finally relax from summer vacation. I just... Yeah. If I don't catch a cold, I swear. Because I always catch colds after I, like, relax. Almost always. Uh, but yeah. This weekend was fun. Because me and a friend, we actually entered a talent show for my church, and we came in second place. Uh, we did a duet, so it was kind of fun. Uh, yeah. Uh, what musical, you may be wondering? I don't know, maybe? Uh, we sang a song from Wicked. Uh, it was What Is This Feeling, Loathing, that song. It's kind of, it's funny though, unintentionally... The talent show was on the same night as the Tony Awards. And the Tony Awards did like a special celebration for the 10th anniversary of Wicked. So I thought that was actually kind of funny and entertaining. Told everyone after the fact, though. So like no one was able to like celebrate that with me. We can get this like storm moat without getting attacked by spiders because spiders for some reason do not like minions spiders and minions do not mix not heading down this cave again almost there it's a good thing this path is so treacherous and leads right to Tor's farm ooh I forgot to mention while we were in the haunted woods I got Roberta the witch's wand I just thought that'd be nice to get from Sophie. I mean, it was only 3,000 Neo points and stuff like that. Not bad. Not bad at all. A lot cheaper than, like, a lot of the other wands that we're getting here. So, yeah. Roberta has a more powerful wand. I think she is faster than Tor. Is she faster than Tor? I don't want her to be faster than Tor. It means that... Oh, wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. Should I? No, I'm not getting Roberta any armor. Nah, not yet. I'll get her some armor later. Like, mm, around the end of Act 3, and then around the end of the last part of the game, she'll get new armor. But yeah, there's the other side of Meridel, which is now protected by that evil force field of cloud. Mm-hmm. This brings back memories. This Let's Play has gotten... is has been longer than most. Well, longer than I, I... It's longer than I thought it would be. Oh, hold on. I just remembered. Wait for it. And go. Yeah! That's right. <laughs> I knew this guy was going to be at the end. Nope. Not getting me. I'm poisoned, but who cares? That'll wear off soon. Now, if you're like, you just passed Prince Torin, why don't you go save Prince Torin? With, you know, you have that, like, letter quest from the princess. Uh, we can't actually turn that in right now. He's kind of been, he's kind of being driven insane by the clouds. Uh, so yeah. What we have to do is head to the farm, talk to our family, see if they can tell us what's going on. See if we can make any sense of what's going on. Um, old man Boggs? No? Okay. It seems like a lot of our farmer's friends are missing. 
Wait, what? Okay, I thought I was being attacked by something. Guess not. No water moats in here today. Okay. Always check and see if there's water moats in there. If you're really lucky, they'll be there at the beginning of the game. You can get that treasure chest easily, but eh, whatever. Well, thank you for listening to me talk nonsensically for a few minutes while we're walking everywhere. This really needs a fast travel system. This game would have been better with a fast travel system. Mom? Dad? Jesus! Ah, not even. Winnie Pen. <gasps> Lucy. No, Lucy, what happened to you? It's my fault. I didn't weed the plants good enough. Now they've come back to get me. You don't understand. Tentacles came out of the ground. They took everyone. Peter, Luke, Farmer Addison, Edison, Farmer Tessa, even Old Man Boggs, everyone. All dragged away into the Shadow Glen. Well, now we know where we're going. Lucy, don't worry. I'll save you, my annoying sister. Yeah, now we have to walk all the way back to the Shadow Glen. Uh, that won't take too long, though, right? Uh, but first, I think this might be a good place to end off. So, this is Laurels. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want for more Neopets the Darkest Fairy. Also, be sure to check out places such as Facebook and Twitter for more reliable updates when new episodes will be coming out or when new special episodes will be coming out for that matter. Tee hee hee. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. Freaking walking everywhere. This video is over 30 minutes long in my recording time. Mm -hmm.